Hey, Boss Bass here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make an inline spinner bait. First thing you're going to need is a guitar string. Next, you're going to need a blade, two beads, some kind of plastic, a bullet weight. A hook and a swivel. To cut your wire, you're gonna just need some wire cutters and some needle nose pliers to bend the wire. First thing you're gonna do is take about 10 inches or so of the wire, clip that off. Then you're gonna take your hook. Thread it on there about inch, inch and a half, half inch. Oops. Crimp it down there. And twist the hook. Turn the hook around a few times. Looks like that. You're going to take your hands and make one or two tight wraps on there. So the first wraps are kind of wide and then the next ones are tight, close together. Just clip it off. Alright, next you're going to take your bead, your glass bead, any color works, red, blue, green, white, clear. Thread it on there, all the way down to the end. Then you're going to take your bullet weight, quarter ounce. Put that on there, the wide end first. So the this little gap in the in there, so the bead will just fit snugly against that weight. Then you're gonna take another bead, just like that, and put it on there. Next, take your blade, this is just a willow blade, put it on there so the, the part that isn't sloped facing down. Then you get your swivel, your swivel, see, put it on there as close as you can to the blade, the same thing you did with the hook. Bend it a little bit. Take your pliers. Crimp it down. And twist it a few times. I'm going to shorten this a little bit, make it easier to wrap. Hanging just like that. Then clip it close to the wire as possible so no weeds will get on that and mess up the blade turning. Then with your plastic, just Texas rig it like with any kind of plastic on a wide gap hook. Thread it through. Move it up, turn it, and put it through, straight through, just like that.
rice and weedless, and you can take the uh, point of the hook and bed it in the skin of the plastic like that. So there's a little hump there. It's not a big deal at all. If there's a little hump there, it still swims fine, but totally weedless. And that's how you make an inline spinner bait. Take that through grass, deep water, shallow water, murky, clear water, any kind of water. You can even take a buzz bait blade and put it up on top to make just an inline buzz bait. And, um, yeah, there's the spinner. Thanks for watching.